Coming to Australia, as you said, um, your parents pretty much sold up on everything. That would have been challenging, you know, coming to a country where you didn't really have much money and you still need to survive and, and you know, get over here because ultimately you've got the plane ticket, you've landed, but then, we'll, you know, we'll, you got to find work and then support the family. Did you hear any of those stories about from your parents how they actually, yeah, set up here in Australia? Yeah, mate, it was it was tough, right? Um, like we 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 got help from St. Vincent de Paul's, right? So my mum my mum would go would go around um, and and try and pick up some food for us because we only I think we only had like a thousand bucks amongst where that we had yeah there was there was six of us right wow. so 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 that that got us through for the next I, I think for the first three weeks and then and then during that time my mum and dad were basically just just scrounging around looking for work, um, making sure that they, they got enough food for the next week, right? So it was a tough, it was a really tough gig um, until such a time where, my, so my mum's a professional pianist and singer. So she got her first gig at one of the hotels in the Gold Coast, fantastic. So, so that was great. And then um, my dad picked up a managerial role in, in one of the, well, it was a time zone actually. Um, so I, I really enjoyed that. Oh, yeah, my <laughs> cut my teeth in a few video games there, mate. <laughs> so, so that was that was really good. Um, but yeah, so prior to that, mate, it was it was hard going. But they didn't really show us what the issues were. So they did a fantastic job of of hiding the stress that they that they would have felt. Right. So, so all in all, mate, it was a it was a stellar job that they've done. Mm-hmm.